Hi, I'm Mr. Rockwell. Uh, sorry I couldn't be here tonight. Um, I've got to coach a game over in Anderson. But uh, I'm hoping you guys can enjoy this video. Uh, I've gotten to know some of you. I'm hoping to meet all of you here in the future. Uh, some things about me, I'm your, uh, your child's science and social studies teacher. Uh, right, currently, we are, we're learning about the 50 states, which uh, you should have seen homework. Uh, go home last night at Yellow Sheen, and uh, we'll be having a test on Thursday. What I'd like to do now um, is to show you um, some of the things that we're offering here in fifth grade. Uh, speak to you about the bring your own device, and uh, obviously give you my email in case you guys have any questions. I'm really happy, very open to communicate with you. First and foremost, one of the important things this year is uh, fifth grade has a new website. Um, finally spent the summer, knocked it out, and it's called Delshire5.com. You see the logo there. Uh, and, uh, but Delshire5.com, and it has just about everything you can imagine. And uh, one of the first and foremost things that I we really get parents have some homework is we need you all to go on to this site and then go to where it says links over here, and it says student parent survey. And if you can click on that, student parent survey, it'll actually have you. There's a survey for you to fill out, which will give you the uh, opportunity to give us your email, some contact information. Let us know some particulars about your child in case we need to fill some of that out. One of the uh, new things also this year is that we'll not be uh, having agendas. So you might be wondering, well, what, well, what's going on? What does my child have for homework? Well, what we have done is we've created a Google Calendar, which is through this website that anyone can access on their smartphone, on a computer, um, and in different views. So if you go to Delshire 5 and you go to Calendar and you click on it, you can scroll down and through here it has little different things. And currently, as you saw today, uh, it says open house right now. It says their homework every day is for 20 minutes. Um, it says tomorrow they're going to study their 50 states, tell you when their tests are. Um, just like that, it has every day kind of planned out. It's also what assemblies are as well. There's also a view of an agenda. Smart board doesn't really But an agenda view, if you look more of a list reader, um, I find this really convenient because I can add to it on my phone as I'm going. If you have your phone, you can do it as well. So it's all right there. Um, that's kind of our agenda here. If you ever wonder what's going on daily in science or social studies, if you click on social studies or science, depending on what it is, every day when the kid walks in, they've got a list of tasks they have to do. Um, this kind of shows what all went on in the homeroom. And down here at the bottom shows what went on in social studies today. Uh, we did our homework. Uh, we worked on our landforms, the mountains, and the rivers of the, of the country. And then we put some bingo to help them study. And then, like I said, they had a big test. Uh, some other things that are on here is behavior. If you go to the behavior link, um, it says recess wall under here. And if you click on the recess wall, you can see the names of everybody who's on recess. So if you want to know if your child's behaving, you can get on there and you can tell who missed recess that day. Usually, uh, we don't call home. Um, it's a minor fraction, like maybe this one was in class or disrespectful. Just have them sit on the wall for five or ten minutes and then maybe they can exercise to get off or if it was severe, maybe just have a full recess. Um, a detention or something like that, we uh, will obviously call home. So that's the behavior wall. We've got our media. There's all different types of things here. We have the school announcements, which the kids are probably, whenever they're on, you can click here to watch. Um, we have our Facebook page, which is a way to get out there. Papers. One of the new things too, your child's probably been talking to you about, um, at Kamal was grabbing jobs, which is on the inside of my door. When you guys come in, um, if you want to check out my room at 210, it's a list and we kind of sign stuff. You can click on the list over here and it'll tell you the jobs. Like someone could be taking care of the bearded dragon, you could be the, the floor sweeper, the paper passer out, the, the Monday floor table. So all different types of things there. But the idea here is to have a website a place for everyone to communicate. And if you ever have a question about your child, what does he need to do? Um, I don't feel like being pushed enough or any questions like that, you can contact us. Um, and there's a link right here that says contact, which has our has all of our emails as well. Um, and you can do that. So um, I'm looking forward to a great year. Uh, again, I apologize for not being able to be here. I'm sure Ms. Tudor, Mr. Miller, Mr. Swineford, and Ms. Burns do a great job explaining what's going on. But um, you can always email me at the, the below number uh, email right there. And I hope to see you all soon. Thanks a lot. Hey, I'm back. Uh, one thing I forgot was to bring your own device. One thing we're offering here at Delshire this year is that students can bring in their own iPad, tablet. Um, also, they can bring in a smart book, a netbook, 
or a laptop. Um, one of the things we do have here is a free Wi-Fi that's open to anybody that's here, and that is Guest OHLSD, like it should be showing up down at the bottom here. Um, you can try it now on your smartphone or on your thing, on any kind of device you have, and you should be able to access the internet here. Um, the idea by having to bring your own device, what we're hoping to do is that each kid can hopefully have a computer, because we do have a lot here, but we don't have enough for every student. And the idea is too, is that maybe they'll run a little quicker, um, we can say, and then they can start our projects here at school, and then continue it on at home. Um, we can't really extend the school day through hours, but the idea is they can continue working. Because as in the professional world, you take your things with you, you go to the coffee shop, you keep working, and we're just trying to get that culture um, kind of integrated, since that's where the workforce is headed in the future. So, um, there's a letter that Ms. Tudor or Mr. Miller and can send home with you here. You can take a look at that. Uh, if you have any questions, um, please let me know. And uh, thanks again. And sorry for the extreme close-up. Bye.